yesterday I went to a castle to explore with you guys. When I got there, I got caught by security because apparently they shot a TV show called I'm a Celebrity Get Me Out of Here in that castle. Usually they film it in Australia, but because of COVID they had to film it in Wales and for some reason they're still there, they're occupying the space, so I'm not allowed to explore it. So that whole day yesterday was just a bust. What up dudes? Just jumped over that wall over there. And now I'm in the woods. And there's a golf course over there. And then after the golf course, there's an abandoned castle. The castle is technically not abandoned anymore. Um, the show, I'm a Celebrity Get Me Out of Here, they renovated it. They put like a million into renovating it so they could use it for their show because COVID wouldn't allow them to go film in Australia where they usually film. So I don't know what the situation is anymore. So over here is the golf course. The castle's over there. The trouble is, I didn't check to see if the filming was was concluded, if they finished. Because if they haven't, then this, this site's going to be full of workers. But anyway, which can be sneaky. Try and get around. Gotta go this way. Through all this. There's a lot of lights around here. It's not good. There's a fire. So after rummaging through the woods for 20 minutes, I came to a security guard who had a fire going and I was like, crap, he's probably already seen me. So I just, just decided to walk towards him hoping that he might not be there because I saw his little base, but anyway, I walked towards him and he's obviously there. He's he's just sitting, sitting on that entrance and he's like, where'd you come from? How'd you get here? So I just came clean. I'm like, hey, I wanted to go see the castle. What's with all the lights and all, all the machinery? Because there's so many vehicles there. And he's like, they filmed I'm a Celebrity here. Did you not watch it? I'm like, dude, I don't own a TV. Why would I watch your crappy show? Yeah, that's a bust. Such unfortunate. So, decided to drive to England to visit Charlie. And then this morning, we got up at 7 to pick up Carter. Pick up him. And then we tried to explore Denby Mental Asylum. I've been there before, but I didn't vlog it when I was there last time. For whatever reason. So I thought... It's better to go there sooner than later before they destroy it or rebuild it. We get there, there's tons of vehicles outside. There's loads of builders. There's even two police there. There's a police van and a police car. They're patrolling the whole thing. They put a wall all around it as well. There, no one can go in or out. So I didn't know this. So this is me telling the Urbex community that Denby Mental Asylum is off limits now. We can't go there. If you really wanted to, you could probably go there at night time, but I don't know. I don't know if it's a bit, if it's, if it's worth it. They are refurbishing it. They're fixing the whole thing. Walking with them. A robin is just photobombed my shirt. Oh, that's such a nice shot. Two days in a row has been a bust. Now we're here, we're in Better Sequoia. This is like half an hour away from where I live. I figured if, if urbexing isn't working, we'll just do nature, because nature's nature, it's always available. And that's where we're at. They're all she. <laughs> I 
One of my favourite forests. We're about to just walk in, walk in through the trees, or the baby trees. I think she was on one of the towers. Been following these random foot trails for a while now through the woods. Found a few a few abandoned houses. This one was the largest of the few that we found. It's a very nice old cottage. For whatever reason, they moved out and left it. And now it'll be reclaimed by a Mother Earth. A lot of nails. The roof collapsed. I know. Yeah. It's kind of still intact though, which is nice. Short people must have lived there. In Switzerland? Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Is it nice? Oh, the best place I've ever been. Is it warm? In the summer, yeah. Not in the winter. It's snowy, isn't it? Yeah. In the summer, it's like 43. Maybe. Fahrenheit or Celsius. Yeah, close up to the action. Close up to the action. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want one I'm scared of height. <laughs> no. 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 No! <laughs> you just, just want to kill both of us. Yeah! I said you wanted to go into the woods to kill us, and I'm trying to push us back up the cliff. Careful. <laughs> Oh, there's snow on your mountains, aren't there? Yeah. The one behind my house is, is clear, but it's not as, that tall. Yeah. I would want to do one of the bigger ones, one of the like actual snowy ones. Okay. The snow didn't. The tallest one is like 60% snow at the moment. Oh so wow. It'd be really hard to, to do. Do you think it's deep up there already or not? Yeah. 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 If you go off trail, it'll, it'll go up to your knees. But on trail, like when you're walking on the train track, it's, it's about a foot deep. There we go. We can go and build a, our igloo up there then. Lost. Well, uh, sheep. Hello, sheep. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love those sheep. They have really gruff faces. Oh, oh. that sounded bad. Step over. Is, um, your, is your leg over? No. Keep, yeah, Hold keep on. going. Keep going. And then if you get caught, I'll, I'll undo it. Yeah. Yeah. Are you stuck anywhere? Yeah. Where? Uh, that part there. Oh, don't let me oh yeah, I see, I see, I see. Yeah, I got it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you got... Ah, wow. <laughs> you got it. I didn't even film it. The road is that way, I think. <laughs> I think it's thick. We ain't capture the sound, we'll try. 
okay? Yeah, I'm trying to get the sound. Oh, that's oh, right nice, isn't it? Oh, we made it to a road. It's pretty thorny. Oh, I wouldn't touch that. Oh. So now I don't know where we are. No. Not a clue. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't, I've literally had it all when it comes to. V pick up? Oh gosh. V, yeah. Yeah, your sense is so low. Should be able to do like a 360 deal there. No, you, you don't. <laughs> I mean, that's nice, being able to just hit stuff like that. Mm hmm, yeah. Yeah. That's so nice. How do you miss anything with a mouse? There we go, exactly. This hurts, I've never done this before. Yeah. There's six people watching me? What? Why? How? <laughs> They're watching. They're watching a bot. <laughs> Crouch. That's, that's crouching. That shift. How do I know? Crouch shift. <laughs> So, what's code? Four. Four. Yeah. Four, control. And, and R. And R? How do well, you yeah, do that R is four. Hand? Yeah. What? Yeah. This is why you can't build the boxes. How are you supposed to do that and move at the same time? That hurts. <laughs> if that was now that far away from the job. Move, m move the keyboard then. Yeah. That's why, that's why people move it at an angle. So that it's more comfortable for that's them. That's not, I, I can't, I don't have six fingers. Cute. How do I floor? Oh. Uh. What? Control. Let's go. Q. Oh crap. Oh crap. Let's go. Yo. Um, I want that. That uh, wall. Control. Yeah, you need to get out. V, I need the fish. Oh, yeah. V, v and P. Yeah, take me out. Yeah, there we go. Goodbye. Bye. <laughs> what a long couple of days. I've driven so much, and we're finally back at Charlie's place. Took Carter home. We went in and out of Wales many times a day. I'm, I'm so tired. Just wanted to say thank you for watching this video, whatever it ends up being. I haven't edited it yet. I've been lying on the ground for the past hour. I realised that trying a daily vlog in winter is very ambitious. There's not much daylight, even though today was a full day. Woke up at 7, got home at 8. Despite that, it's exhausting. Like, drove a few hundred miles today to, just to get turned down, doing the one thing we wanted to do, and then exploring some nature, which is nice. But yeah, that's just the reality of daily vlogging, is you try and push yourself to do something interesting for content and for personal enjoyment. And sometimes it doesn't work out, and you end up with whatever this is. So, hope you enjoyed it anyway. Um, I'll be back in tomorrow, hopefully. I do apologise for missing two vlogs this week. It's just, hey, some days nothing happens, and it's not worth making a nothing video. I think when I'm back home, I'll get a bit more disciplined, and I'll write down some ideas so that when nothing happens, I can still film something. Okay, thanks for watching. I've been Jason. Check out my store. Thanks to everyone that's been supporting. Um, your packages should all go out, hopefully, for Saturday. I'm a bit backlogged at the moment. Anyway, peace.